Creations doing on this amazing, amazing Monday, Monday, Monday. I hope you guys are doing absolutely fantastic. Hi guys. I feel like so awkward um, because I haven't uploaded obviously in quite some time. I was looking at my like YouTube studio and it was like 60 something days ago and I'm like holy cow. Uh, so that's like
those silent battles, but if they are so severe and they are so where you are going to need an army to fight those battles, talk to people. Don't keep it to yourself. Talk to people. To the moments when you fell but still chose to rise again and look forward, you are a warrior. So do yourself a favor. Celebrate your strength. Sometimes we're like, oh yeah, we're healed or we did that. Like, that's okay. But that that's you. Some people, it takes them forever to get through certain trials and paths and stuff, and you did it. So that's what I was trying to think of myself. I'm like, I I, I managed to, to be the better person that I am. Like, I managed to break out of this, this craziness, and that's huge. Another one, it's very small, but you can't heal. You can't heal. If you pretend you're not hurt, that's the biggest thing is like me asking for help was so hard for some like for some instances like certain people I could talk to more than others and obviously that's your safe space like I do have a lot of people on this platform that come to me and they talk to me about things and that's great I love being your safe space even if I don't like personally know you but obviously if it's like certain situations where you need to talk to like a like a therapist or somebody that's professional that's always fine too you're not weak no one's gonna if people look at you weird for saying i have to go to therapy this these weeks and everything it doesn't matter you're trying to fix you good for you good for you that's all that matters you are taking care of yourself and i think that's the most freaking awesome and just i don't swear but bad but bad but thing that is the the best thing you could do is taking care of yourself because you know what you're not caring what other people think you're not it's it's so crucial to start thinking about yourself and loving yourself because listen that is so amazing um, another one i found was the things that hurt you may have left scars but they did not destroy you. You survived and there is hope in that. Which is so baffling because we're constantly getting beaten down and you know at there's a light at the end of the tunnel and when you go to it, you like literally there's like a breath of fresh air there's times where I go through like I'm so nervous like like dealing with something. If a state's coming to my work or something's going on I get so nervous and once I'm in the process of doing and it's done. I'm like, I did it. This, it's so funny, like that. Like I have some anxiety driving. So somebody invited me and my daughter to go to a zoo, and I would never drive to this place because I was terrified of how the highways are and all that stuff. And I got there, and I was so proud of myself for because not only did I did for myself, I did for my daughter. And I like, I, but I did it. I pushed myself. My mind told me I couldn't do it. I didn't care. I was willing to get here. I was willing to put my, push my anxiety aside and get there. And that is huge, huge to do. So do it. You're going to have scars. Those are your battle scars, okay? Those are your scars you can look back on and be like, I accomplished this. Healing doesn't have to look magical or pretty. Real healing is hard, exhausting, and draining. Let yourself go through it. Don't try to paint it as anything other than what it is. Be there for yourself without judgment. I think we kind of like sugarcoat things. We're like, I'm fine. Yeah, I, I didn't sleep good last night, but I, I'm okay. But you didn't sleep good last night because you're dealing with a lot going on in your mind. Express it. Obviously, express it to people that you trust and you love. Um, you know, I, I've i gotten messages from people asking if I'm okay, and I 
his word says, obviously. But he gave us free will, so we have choices to make. And, you know, he's going to guide us with every choice you make. But remember, if you're trying to heal, don't put those crazy people away. You don't need them. They're just making your... Yeah. <laughs>